Back at 8.32 this morning, Rickley Bills paying tribute to a radio legend. He passed away early yesterday morning after a long battle with cancer. Roseanne is live with a look back at his life and legacy. Roseanne, good morning. Well, good morning, T. Well, Lynn Bramer, who often reminded us he was our best friend in the whole world, is being remembered all over the city today by fans at music venues like the Metro down the street here in Wrigleyville that had his name up on the marquee. And also here at Wrigley Field, Everybody knows Lynn was a huge Cubs fan, and his name is in lights here as well. While many of us remember listening to Bramer mornings on XRT for more than 30 years, he was actually at the station for 40, 10 of them as music director. He had fallen in love with music and radio in college, and he became a musical encyclopedia. He had some of rock's biggest stars in his studio over the years. Last summer, he announced he was dealing with prostate cancer and was off the air for a time, but he came back in November thanking fans for, as he put it, the beautiful words that kept him afloat. Many fans now say opening day will never be the same without Bramer, who hosted his radio show from Yoxies each year. For so many of us, it's a tradition that goes through generations. There are people that go to opening day at Wrigley Field every year. I know I have, like... I don't know, 29 out of the last 30 years. Look on social media today and over the next few days as word gets out and see how many people collectively Lynn has been smiling and having his arms around um, from all over the world. And that was Norm Weiner, the former program director at XRT. And boy, did he get that right. If you look on Twitter, Countless people have posted those pictures because Lynn Bramer would throw his arm around you and take a picture with you at a game or a concert any time. Now, starting today at 10 a.m., his colleagues at WXRT will be paying tribute to Lynn Bramer, who was really a Chicago treasure. Um, expect to hear a lot of love and a lot of great stories as well. Back to you guys.